Where did Naima go? Where is she? There she is! <laughs> yeah! Oh! Louie, where's Ava? I can't see her! Where did she go? Oh, there she is! Oh, wow! I can't see her anymore! Where did she go? Oh, there she is! Good morning, guys. So, Ava and I are just having some ice cream. Can Daddy have a look? Thank you, you're such a good sharer. This kid is so obsessed with her ice cream. She has this little pretend ice cream and she carries it around with her everywhere. I swear it tastes just like ice cream in her head. Wow, that's some good ice cream. Dude, she needs to sell that recipe to Messina. I know, right? <laughs> Ava, <laughs> Ava flavored toy ice cream. Mm. <laughs> Look at her. Hey, can I have another lick? I feel like I'm not tasting what you're tasting. Can I have some more? No. No? It's just like you, you got one bite. Uh -huh. Thank you. Today's going to be a pretty chill day. I'm going to go get a haircut today. I'm going to start packing for Singapore. Man, I just checked the weather and literally every day I'm going to be in Singapore, it's going to be storming, which I'm pretty devastated about because I really want to go and see the gardens and stuff and that may impact that. But I'm still going to make the most of it. I'm still excited about my trip. I leave on Tuesday. Something super awkward just happened to me. I just came into the hairdressers and I realized that yesterday I bought a new wallet and I put all my cards in the new wallet and I had to explain to them that I have no money. Luckily I've been coming here for years and they trust me enough to actually come back and pay them. What do you guys think? <laughs> Kelly did a good job. She, I went a little bit shorter than normal. I did the, the zero on the side, the fade. I really like it. I wasn't sure in the beginning, and Ellie talked me into it, and yeah, I'm glad I did. Thanks, Ellie. Confession time. I wasn't really a big fan of buying the Range Rover Evoque. I was kind of hoping Nikki would get something else, just because I feel like it's, it's a really girly sort of a car. But to be completely honest, I have been loving driving this car. Pretty much any opportunity that I get to drive it, I want to drive it. It is so nice to drive. It just feels so luxurious on the inside. And honestly, I never thought we would ever be in the position where we could purchase a new car. Every time I drive it, I just think about how blessed we are because, you know, if you've been watching the vlog for a while, once upon a time we bought our old Jazz and to us that was an amazing accomplishment. So to be able to get this, it's just, it doesn't seem real still. And when I say accomplishment, don't get it twisted. Something that I really hate about society today is people judge success on material things like you see people posting pictures of lamborghinis and ferraris and you know having inspirational quotes around them and i don't think you should ever judge success on material goods material goods are just a bonus honestly to me being successful is having a job you love doing and being happy and your family being happy sorry that was just a random rant i know some people hate my rants some people like them. Probably more people hate them. What up, haters? It used to be we couldn't get her to eat. Now she sees food and she just takes it straight from you. Okay. I don't think McDonald's is for you. I don't think it should even be for me either. I went and I bought that cheeseburger that we had on the road trip again. It's so good. <laughs> It's my birthday tomorrow, yay! 
I'm turning 27. I'm actually excited to turn 27 though. Like some people are really scared about getting older, but honestly, I'm just like, I love it. I'm embracing it. So tonight my friends Jen and Phoebe are actually going to take me out for like a girls dinner. You know, we're going to eat some food, have some lovely dessert, drink some wine. I can't wait for that. And then tomorrow is my actual birthday. Jamie's got a lunch planned for us. And then I think I'm going to go and just like see my family and see the kids and see Ava play with the kids and everything. I think that would be really nice. So I went to the shopping center, same time as Jamie. I actually went and picked out a few things. I was trying to find an outfit for later on tonight. Hey, wait, hold on. Where am I going to put you guys? Because this is quite hard to do. Okay. There, I'm gonna put you guys there, but you can't see my face. <sighs> okay, you can see me now. But can you see the clothes doll? <laughs> oh my gosh. I recently bought these Tony Bianco boots that I absolutely love. You guys know I wear my Diddy boots all the time. They're from Tony Bianco as well. And they're like the Kanye boots. They come up to the ankle, but I've always wanted the knee high ones. But because my legs are so skinny, I didn't know which ones would fit me. And like, because the Diddy boots fit my ankles really well, and they're super, super skinny. I figured that the thigh high ones would fit me as well. So I bought them. I'll show you guys them actually. This might be just the mini haul. <laughs> but yeah, they're basically just this material. And I tried these on and they fit me. I'm so good. I was like, thank you, Jesus. I never thought I'd see the day. If you are tall and you have skinny legs, you know the struggle of finding boots that fit us, you guys. So when I found these, I was like, yeah. I went and bought this skirt, which I just love, 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 love. This was $99. It looks a lot better on you guys. I know you're probably like, mm, I don't know about that girl, but it actually looks super cute on. And then to go with that, I got this ruffle top. Guys, I'm so into ruffle tops right now. This is from Sheik as well, and this was $79. And I got this in an extra small. And I just love these ruffle sleeves lately. I just want to do the cha-cha every time I'm in them. But yeah, it's like a really cropped sweater. And the arms are cropped as well. Like, they just come three-quarter there. So yeah. And also, it's freezing tonight. So I didn't want to wear anything that was, like, going to make me feel too cold. I don't wear earrings very often, but I saw these and I was like, Oh! <gasps> They're so cute. And they will go really, really well with my outfit. So I can't wait to wear these tonight. Who are you playing with? Dad. Are you Dr. A.V.? You show mommy. Show mommy your doctor skills. What's that? <laughs> She's going to wear them low like daddy. <laughs> Just what I was thinking. <laughs> I think that's why he bought them. So I got her this little skirt. It's got stars all over it. I thought it'd be cute with this jumper. This jumper here. And I got her plain blue jumper as well. With stars on it. And just some more hair accessories that she always happens to pull out. But these are really cute. I thought I could put her hair in pigtails and put one on. H. She wants this thing. So, if anyone wants to know what this is, <laughs> this is a lint shaver. So, all these little lint balls on our couch are making it look really old and I'm not liking it. So, I went and bought this lint shaver from Spotlight and hopefully this will do the trick. I was meant to take this little comb thing out before I started, but it's a little late now. Here, it's starting to look a lot better. Let's see, this has got all the lint. So, let's give this a go. And you can hear that it just like picks them all up. Let's see if it makes a difference. How much 
much lit I've collected so far. I've done this one square here. Let's see if you can see the difference on camera. I'm not sure if you'll see it, but thanks a lot, Ava. Okay, so this side obviously hasn't been done yet. You can see all the lint balls. And this side, there's like none. Yay, it's a success. So quick update on my little plant. Well, it's quite a big plant now. It's leaves are coming all the way out here. I think I need to tie it together so that it, you know, sits straight like that. But yeah, it's doing really, really well. Its leaves are looking nice and healthy, except for this one here. But for the most part, it's doing pretty good, except this child here. Yeah, this is exactly what she's been doing. Yeah. Are you showing them what you've been doing? So she's been coming up and grabbing all these bits out of here. And now the roots up here are pretty exposed. So I went and got some potting mix so I can cover it up a little bit. Okay, supposed to be putting potting mix in, not pulling it out. Well, that's it for today's vlog. As per always, thanks for hanging out with us. If you like the vlog, hit the thumbs up, subscribe, all that jazz. We didn't actually vlog on Nikki's birthday, which was yesterday. She had a really, really good day. I took her out for a nice romantic lunch. And then we took Ava down to play with the kids and she had a really good time. It was a really fun day. Also, I'm still really wanting to do this meetup while I'm in Singapore. It looks like the weather's gonna be really bad though. So I'm gonna have to find somewhere that's like indoors. So Singapore people, if you wanna hang out, please leave me some suggestions of places that's like indoors that we won't get in trouble for doing a meetup. I'm guessing it's just going to be a relatively small meetup anyway. If you guys can just leave some suggestions in the comments and we'll figure something out. I think it's probably going to be on Saturday.